What's going on everyone? TM24Plays here and I've got another Marvel Snap video for you. Today we're going to be playing a deck full of only two drops and we're going to see if we can win a game or maybe a couple. The one, the one drops definitely surprised us so let's see what the two can do. Now coming up with the strategy for the two is a little bit easier than the one. We do have Bucky and Carnage which can supply us some power. Hopefully Goose can lock down a lane. And we're including Beast in this one as well, in case we want to bring some cards back to our hand, get out of a lane we're losing, and go towards one that we can win. Um, of course, Angela's going to supply us some power, and we've got cards like Lizard that is just good for its cost. Um, but, for now, let's see if we can get any wins with uh, this deck. Please remember to subscribe and like the video. I am working my way towards 100 subs. We're about 19% of the way there, so we're at 19, and any help would be greatly appreciated, but we'll see you in the gameplay. All right, only two drops here. We're going up against Archangel. We do get Beast in hand, so that's nice. Weird World, okay, so we're drawing from his deck, and we pick up an Electro. We're definitely gonna start with the Scorpion. And we pick up a She-Hulk. Oh, wow. So we definitely see the route that he was going. Scorpion comes down. He drops a Bucky right away. Whoever has the least power here wins. Okay. We're going to drop Wiz uh, Lizard into Weird World. He's going to stack on Mirror Island. There's Carnage. That was the combo we were talking about for a light, nice little power boost, but... He hits it instead. We pick up a vision as well. I feel like we need to get cards down onto Mirror Island, otherwise we have no chance of uh, catching up there. He's using all of my two drops. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Turn five. So we see what he's got going on. If he really just uses all my cards to beat me here, I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> Armor and Angela. I think we're going to play just Sunspot. We're at 16. Mojo's going to get plus 6. I think we just got beat with our own deck. This brings us up to 26, 30. Let's just play this and... Uh, see what happens here he drops a magneto we just got beat with our own deck wow everything except that magneto and the armor were my cards but hey good on him well played so we're not starting very strong with this 0-1. Try number two for this uh, two-cost only deck. We have Beast, we've got Medusa, we have Goose, and we've got some power with Lizard. And we're going up against Goose Goose. He drops a Rocket Raccoon. Turn six cards can't be played here, okay. We're definitely going to try and get a couple of those uh, reveals off of Medusa. Just to stack some power there. When you play a card here, return it to your hand. We need Mr. What do we need? Yeah, we need Mr. Sinister. We're going to drop Goose on the Hellfire Club. Thor comes down. 
do pick up Mojo. We're going to have to play him in this center lane. <clears throat> They're going to get reduced in cost, so they won't be able to play in Hellfire Club. We need to find a way into Luke's bar. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and slam. We're gonna slam as much as we can on the vault right now. We're gonna get a little proc off of Medusa. She's gonna be six. He drops a white tiger. Of course, it hits Luke's bar. Neil there keeps coming down. Oof. We pick up Bucky. All right, we're going to have to get out of this one. We're going to start 0 and 2 right now. Um,. So, off to a, a much rougher start than uh, the one drops, but let's keep going. Let's see if we can get a win with this deck. All right, some more two drops. Two for two. We do pick up Beast and Medusa. That's a nice little combo, and we're getting some power. We pick up Bucky as well. He could be huge. Atlantis. We're definitely, I think we want to get Angela down first. We'll play Medusa onto her, and then we'll play Mojo and Medusa on turn four, depending on what else our hand shows us. We do pick up a Mr. Sinister. He would have been nice last game. We're going to take the proc on Medusa. <coughs> they drop a Thor again. We do pick up Carnage, and we have Bucky. The question is, do we play that now, or do we wait? I think we want to get that power down now. So we're going to play that now. Next turn, we'll go Mojo and Beast. And I'm thinking we're probably going to have to go after Fisk's Tower. We're in a good spot. I think we could get this one. We do. We want a free mojo, right? Well, I'm not free. A one cost. Yeah, we definitely do. He's snapping. I still... I feel pretty good about our, our setup here. So, I'm going to... I'm going to at least see what we... What he plays. He pulls out Jane. I think we can fully expect the hammer Mjolnir to come down here. So we're going to see if we can snake this lane. only got two cards left that we're getting play out of we're gonna leave the Wakandan Embassy it doesn't matter which one we play we're gonna play Scorpion and Mojo let's see if we get this dub oh he threw everything into the Wakandan Embassy man that is not great for us black cat comes down he's already got enough there we can't touch Thor we might not even be able to catch him here Mjolnir comes down again. Let's see what type of power we get, though. We, w we did take Fish Tower, so if he would have played anywhere else, we could have had it. But um, that's another loss for our two drops, and that one hurt. That was four cubes. I thought we had a shot at that one. I did not see the lockjaw coming, but we're just going to keep rolling. See if we can get a win with this, with this deck here. 
All right, Mojo World. So Mojo in the Mojo World. That only seems right. Everything costs less. We're going to get Medusa down right away as well as Scorpion. <clears throat> he does end up playing. He plays his own Scorpion. Medusa gets her buff. Cards can't be destroyed here. Okay. We do pick up Goose. We're going to slam Goose onto Mojo World. Plays Lockjaw and the Wisp into Infinite. Man, we are in trouble now. This, this one might already be too far gone for us to pull it back. We're going to try, though. We're going to have Carnage eat everything in this lane. think we're gonna be able to catch him here we're gonna go ahead and back out oh and four oh and four this is a big difference from uh our one cost deck we actually got wins right off the jump with that one but hey we're gonna keep trying we're gonna go until we get a dub we have beast so that's great we do have okoy as well i think we want to get okoy down Send her back to hand and do it again. I kind of want to get her down here, though. All right, so we got that buff. Oh, already hit Medusa. We can get a double proc on Medusa as well. We're going to drop her in the middle. They play a brood. We're going to Scorpion into Beast, and we're definitely going to play these two next turn. Mr. Fantastic. He's got a bunch of three drops here. we have to play into this lane we need to keep we need to keep up and right now i just i don't think we are let's throw angela out into that left lane maximus to give us some more options i wish i would have had mojo for right here all right as of right now we are up in Mir island gonna drop goose lizard colossus storming away and a polaris to pull a scorpion that actually is is not terrible for us Carnage does not help us. So, Mr. Sinister. Do we think he's going to play? He's got all three drops. He's got to have Silver Surfer in his hands. Let's just play it out see what happens. There's Cosmo coming down. There's Silver Surfer. Just like we thought. We're going to end up short again. We do have a lot of power coming out, though. More power than the, the one-cost deck, but we just can't seem to get there. Five power short. We 
would have been short no matter what we did there, but we're going 0 and 5. Yikes. I did not expect this from the two cost deck. I honestly thought it would be easier to get a dub than the uh, the one cost. Cards here have minus one power. Colossus will eat that up. He'll keep his three power, so we're definitely going to end up slamming him there. But, of course, we've got Medusa already, so we're going to toss her right into this center lane. Doesn't affect us. We might want to get Scorpion down first just to affect his hand for these future plays. All right. Atlantis. We have Goose as well. We'll get Goose down next turn. Goose Colossus. Yeah, I think I think that's going to be the route to go. He's probably going to eat this Bucky right here. Which means it's going to be six. Hood as well. Oh, man. I don't think this is the game, guys. I do not think this is the game that we finally get a dub with, with this deck. That gives me a little bit of hope because now we can slam our own. Maybe we send it this way, though. And then goose after. I think we're going to try that. Yandu comes out. Beast goes down. Demon comes down. Alright. Colossus. I think we have to send goose as well. Wave. Oh. <clears throat> Not what we were looking for. We can't even play Lizard on that lane anymore. We're going to have to retreat. Oh, in six. Wow. Wow. This is not what I was expecting. Honestly, I thought this deck would be a little bit better. All right, we have an early combo, so maybe maybe this is the game. We've got a shot here. Maybe we'll save that for turn four. We just have to keep one of our lanes open. We have Scorpion to affect his cards. Come on, Kevy Kev. You gonna be the one to give it to me? All right. He's taking his time, he's thinking. He's thinking if he wants to go ahead and throw us this dub or not. Card with the highest power. If we can get Goose down after these two, maybe Bucky wins it. All right, he's playing Domino. Turn four, transform. can always play lizard here as well so we're gonna go ahead and drop goose and then this turn okay we're going bucky carnage next turn we'll go lizard here into the center lane wave is gonna definitely screw us up odin is setting weight off a second in time can we catch him there We might be able to catch him. Hold on. We're going to be able to play three cards next turn. I think we can catch him there. We're going to just play Angela. Oh, he's playing Agatha. Okay. So now it's his turn. Mojo... He loses three power. So she gains two. He's going to gain eight. Yeah, we'll get there if we play one more card there. Ah, 
Ah, we're gonna wind up just short, I think. Maybe this gets us there. It's possible. He plays over to the left lane with Hulk. Are we gonna get our first dub with our two costs? Oh man, and we're gonna get there. We are going to get there. We finally get a dub with only two costs. It only took us seven games to get our first dub. Seven games. But we finally get one. I will say, I've had about enough of this deck. I don't think I can play it anymore. Uh, so that's going to be the end of it. But please remember to subscribe and like the video if you want to see more content like this. And be on the lookout for the next one. We're going to be playing with only three drops. Until then, let's have some fun.